want to bring in co-anchor of Good Morning America, anchor of this week, and my co-anchor tomorrow night for the big Diane? drama. George, you are here. So uh, our latest poll shows three points ahead for the president. And what a difference 10 days makes, Diane. Look at our poll 10 days ago, coming out of the final debate. Mitt Romney was actually the one who was up three points coming out of then. Over the course of the last 10 days, President Obama has steadily closed the gap. They were tied for much of that. But as you say, he is now three points ahead, and he has closed the gap on handling the economy. I think that's what's most important here. There's been a steady stream of encouraging economic news, good jobs numbers, consumer confidence, housing market coming off the bottom, stock market is up. Add that all up, people are feeling better about how President Obama is handling the economy basically tied with Mitt Romney. And, of course, the handling of the storm has also been part of this. But the battleground states, what are we seeing right now? What we're seeing now is the president is either tied or ahead in all of the key battleground states. And Hurricane Sandy had to have helped there as well. The president's job approval is up to 51 percent. And for most of the hurricane, people saw the president doing his job. They basically like what they saw. So, as I said, you look at those battleground states there, president tied or ahead in all the battleground states right now. Well, we will be springing into action tomorrow as the voting begins. And, George, I will see you very soon. See you and, of course, on Good Morning America as well.